twilight of Earth's great civilizations, we were chosen. Some were selected for their skills, others for their strength, and some by luck. Great ships were the embodiment of each nation's ingenuity, courage, and faith. And they sent us to the stars in search of a new home. As we raced skyward, we carried aloft the hopes and dreams of those left behind. Our journey through deep space was long and quiet. It is finally over. Now we look upon our new world for the first time. On these alien shores, our destiny waits. A new beginning. Welcome everybody, I'm your host, Strategic Jordan, and I should turn the music down. Oh god, did it crash? Oh, please don't crash. Um, assuming this thing is still recording, I gotta tell you, that, uh, that opening right there, that, that gets me right into Gamma. Uh, it make, makes me shed a tear. Any second now. I I might have to just cut this out. Okay, we're here. Oh my god, it looks so cute. First things first, probably have to bring this down 10%. I don't want to get my ass sued. Ambience. 55, 75, we'll leave speech at 100. Video, everything should be good. Yes. I wish there was a clock setting, but whatever. Anyways, I'm good. I'm... Ooh, ooh, I want to start. Oh, hi, Japan. So, yeah, I'm your host, Strategic John. And this is Launch Night. Uh, setup game. Fuck that. Oh. If Mer Mercury is normal, then okay. Yeah, standard. No! Eight. Let, let's do the whole thing. Come on. Disney, a sponsor. Arc. Covert. Oh, the race. Oh, it doesn't tell me? Pan-Asian Cooperation. Franco-Iberia. Slavic Federation. Paul-Australia. The Caffian Protectorate. Brasilia. <laughs> African Union. Covert operations 20% faster and cause 20% more intrigue. 
10% production towards wonders, 25% worker speed. Oh, I'm, oh. Get a free technology for every 10 virtues. Oh, that sounds awesome. And I always did like the French Siberia. I, ever since I played the, um, the, uh, Hearts of Iron 2 Armageddon mod, or scenario where France and Iberia was one country, I always liked the look of that. Or you could stay in orbit 20% longer, and the first one launch grants a free technology. That could be useful. Plus, you trade routes. Season outposts. Oh. That could be pretty. They all have really cool stuff, too. Uh, let we're, we're going French. We're the Frenches. Choose the colonists. Do I want scientists? Refugees? Aristocrats? Engineers or artists plus two culture plus one health plus two production plus three aris or energy and one health plus two food plus two science. Oh, well, I'm already going to get free tech, so we'll go artists. Lilia artists. Spacecraft. The Continent Surveyor reveals coasts on map. Cool. Retrograde thrusters. <laughs> Wider arc for choosing where to land the first city. Distal visibility around the starting area. Nice. Tectonic scanner. No technology is needed to see petroleum, geothermal, and titanium. Fusion reactor. Start with 100 energy. I see. Life form sensor reveal alien nests on map. I think we'll go retrograde thrusters. Hydroponics. What do I want for cargo? Begin with extra population. Begin with pioneering. Begin with a clinic building in your first city. That could be good. Let's begin with soldiers. Begin with workers. Oh, I'm getting the fucking machinery. Choose a planet. Kaku. Uh, Jonas. Okay, Terran world. With one ocean and one very large continuous landmass. Mm. Thirsty. A world of islands. Oh, 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 oh. Advanced worlds. I see. Uh huh. Oh, Kepler. Let's do one of these advanced ones. Oh my god, there's a lot of them. One of the oldest known Earth like planets. Uh, Mu, Aria, tidally locked. Yeah, yeah, a punishing cold world, Tau City D. Let's go with Etu Volpralea B. I'm just going to call it Eta. As the continent holds a deep wilderness in its interior, rich with resources and thickly populated with indigenous life. Oh, 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 it's going to be so good. Start that bitch. We have arrived. The new Eden lies below, ready to receive all wisdom and creativity. We have brought all that is good from old earth, and with it we shall make this world better. The glorious culture of Franco Iberia will take root in this alien land and bloom into its full... Oh, does that change depending on what kind of colonist I picked? I picked culture ones, and it's talking about the culture. Oh, does that change and stuff? Oh, that'd be cool. Oh, I'm going to have to play another game immediately after this with, like, engineers and see what happens. I, I really like it lets you outfit your own colony expedition first. That's that's pretty cool. And we're loading again. So excited. Since this is a very special occasion, I actually got a very special cup. It is a golden chalice from the lands known as Disney 
from old earth. A land of fabulous wealth and eternal happiness. Where all go to spend their money for joy and frivolous pursuits. Hello, I am the Advanced Integration and Simulation Resource, or no. Advisor. I am equipped to introduce you to the basic systems that will guide your development on this new planet. Additionally, I can provide strategic advice based on situation. No! No advisors! Oh, there's a lot of good shit over there, but I like coastlines. So I assume this is the area which I could choose to place my city. Damn it, all the good shit's kind of taken up by the miasma. In case you're wondering, this is going to be a hardcore purity playthrough. I know, right? If any of you see my previous channel, you would have thought I would go harmony. Fuck that. Imperium of man. Purity of the gene seed. Follow the emperor. Fra oh, oh, I see that. And I'm going to have... And I see that. I saw that. I saw the Firaxis. Very funny, guys. <laughs> okay, uh... Ah. Uh, ah, production. Clinic gets sign old earth relic. Ooh. Culture. Let's get old earth relics. Now here we have the explorer. Uh, I have no idea what he's supposed to do. Attack, move, do nothing, alert, fortify, explore. We actually have quite the view. Yes, build a plantation, my friends. Now research. Oh my god! Oh dear lord. Okay. Ah oh, yes, purity. More purity. Purity everywhere. Okay. Colonists, trade convoys, trade vessels, trade new parts. Work bar. Okay, we're We're, we're going to get pioneering. Um, let's make repulsor, then I want that, then I want to go over to engineering and then get defense grid. Got it. Good. Oh no, I forgot to look at all that stuff. The temple doors of the Protectorate are open. Who are you? Jite Uh... Yeah, it's cool. Oh, wait, let's go look her up. Units, upgrades, buildings, technologies, game concepts, sponsors and leaders. I don't even know. Here we are. Title, Spiritual Mother. Def oh, I'm going to have problems with this lady. Oh, I'm going to have problems. Didn't I get to choose a leader? What the hell happened here? I don't know. I'll, maybe, I, maybe I was too excited and I completely ignored the leader section. I'll feel pretty stupid if I did. The Western scholars are almost uniformly incredulous. The followers of Kavathia Takar hold fast claims he was born the first day of June, 17 years before the events of the Great Mistake. Why is the Great Mistake? Making her well over... Oh no! I messed up my timer! Uh, uh, 20... Uh, 19 minutes, let's say. 17 years before the Great Mistake, making her well over 200 years old. Bull... 
fucking shit. More reliable estimates concede he may be considerably older than the average life. Oh, okay, maybe not. Bullshit. As the daughter of a revered northern mystic Ra Tahar Takara, I'm I'm going to get bombed. <laughs> oh, I'm going to get many hate messages for both of those. Kithara had a strong spiritual connection at a young age. She often experienced a near catatonic state of disembodied concentration. During which she was said to have visions of the far future. To the devotees of her father, this only served to solidify their belief that she would one day supplant him in his role, as he himself had declared upon her birth. Rise to fame. Nearly 80 years after Raj Takur's journey to the Kush, Kavitar's followers numbered in the hundreds of millions as the stories of her and her father became legend among desperate and forgotten peoples. Despite a number of political and military candidacies tailored for the position, when it came time to elect a leader for the new geographically diverse region under their control, none saw a means to overcome Kavitar's popularity. Swept up in nearly uncontested vote and thrust into position of political authority, she neither desired nor prepared for. Kavithar focused her early efforts on what she knew best, humanitarian campaigns. She focused her vast resources on repairing the damage done by her predecessors to the people of the Indian subcontinent. Let's learn about the Protectorate. Oh dear god. Now, you, you read at your own pace. I'll read at mine. fuck was a great mistake? It looks like it fucked everything up. Yay! Rod sounds like a nice guy. Oh. I mm, I'm going to, have to look up what the hell this great mistake was. There's a uh, I see. How do I do that? How do I do that? I have a quest? Send resource pods ahead of our expedition to be waiting for when we arrive. Mm. Find two resource pods. I'm gonna get that one so that bitch can't take it. Oh, here it is. Launch orbitally. Um, 
How do I get down from here? Somebody help me! I'm stuck in orbit! Okay, there we go. Alright. We have no victories yet, but we're on the way to take that one, so... Miss Crazy... Oh, well, she probably was out there to land. I'm sad now. I know this miasma is poisonous, so... Oh, what are those things? They're clearly a resource. There's so many resources, guys! What does this thing do? Oh, On tiles I own... Oh, I, f I fucked up. I fucked up. I fucked up. What do you mean you need orders? Eh. Oh, that's how I do it. Okay. Yay! Awesome. So I need to start playing my second seaside. Thinking right here with fungus. I get some frax. I, I kind of want to sell one. What's this? Oh, that would actually be really good. Actually, moving down here, another city right here. I get both silica and floatstone. I have no idea what either of those do. I can't move through all that one turn. No, well, let's get the. The, oh, well, I guess I'll make a way to turn. Wait, oh, look, they just popped up. Really? Ah! Oh. Come on, bro. We got culture. Um, nice, cool, mm. um, central planning, yes, yes, please, let's be, let's be communist French purists. What could possibly go wrong? Alright, uh... Clinics? Yeah. Still don't have pioneering. Are you good? You're all good. Is that oil? No, that's not oil. Oh, I can't. I, I'm just so excited. Gifts from home. A piece of install. Nice. We got any more of these quests? 
Oh. I'm ahead of you, bro. The fuck is that? Already? Okay. Generators, sure. My God, these people are just having babies. That's cool. Fraxis. Oh. Good day to you. Okay, who are you? Don't don't look at don't read it. No, 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 no. There we go. Okay, um Again, we'll 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 read at our own paces. Hmm. Oh, now it's a super genius. Innovative and dangerous projects. Hmm. The inflection point? What's that? All right, well, time to learn about the Pan Asia cooperation. Time of tears. Oh. Oh, so Asia is the one that experienced the brunt of the great mistake. War against the Gobi? What? Hmm. The great heavenly leap. Space could be mass produced. Nice. I mean, I kind of wanted to play either PAC or the Slavic Federation. I mean, PAC's always kind of... China's cool. China and Japan working together, that's pretty awesome. And I suppose the rest of Asia. And the Slavic Federation alone just sounds badass. I mean, it, they just sound cool. Dude, you landed on Mars? Strip mine that shit. We 
remember. Our relic has provoked an ideological a s ideological split amongst our citizens. Some believe Old Earth Relic is instrumental as a source of solace for grief people feel of the lost homeworld. They want left in reverence peace as a shrine. Others think it represents a valuable repository of traditional wisdom that must be studied and displayed publicly. Oh, either... Shit. Um... I'm a culture whore. Relics will now be made public resources. Ex I'm gonna have to turn sh shit down. Accessible like any library for any citizen to examine their contents. Early reports indicate they are already spurring insights to the old ways of life. See, uh, that's another thing I like about this. You know, the, the new quests, instead of being big things, they offer glimpses into the daily life of your empire. And that's one thing I always wanted in Civilization games. I want to see how the common people do things. I still don't have fucking pioneering. So until then, let's work on social food. Solid state citizen. Oh dear. A spacecraft plummeting. Th that. I'll, I'm sorry, everybody. That's all time we have for today. I've been your host, Strategic Joan. This is Civilization Beyond Earth. Join us next time as we do Solid State Citizen. Bye.